So we are in front of Bartolo Hall, which everyone here just calls D-Bart, and it is the namesake for the quad that I'm on right now, D-Bart Quad. And this quad is absolutely beautiful, just like they all are, and it houses purely academic buildings. So we have DeBartolo Hall, which is where the majority of the classroom spaces on campus are. We have the law school right in front of me. We have over there one of the engineering buildings. We have the... Mendoza School of Business and the DeBartolo Performing Arts Center at the end of the quad. So I'll give you guys a quick walk through. So I just stepped into DeBart, which has 73 classrooms of all different sizes. The classes held in here are from all disciplines. So you could have anything from a film class to a history class to a linear algebra class in DeBart. And as an engineering student, a vast majority of my classes are in this building. It has the biggest lecture hall on campus, which can hold about 465 people. It also has a computer lounge and a fun study lounge, which I will show you. Let's get into it. So I'm right outside the DBART computer lounge and lounge, and it's supposed to be quiet in there because people do work, but I'll give you a walk through it. And insider's tip, it's a great spot to take a nap because they have nice, big, comfy bean bags. So I am in the biggest classroom on campus. This is DeBartolo 101, and like I said, it holds 465 people. I personally have had one class in here, and it was a class that all computer science majors, computer engineering majors, and electrical engineering majors had to take, and the room was not even full. Um, the teacher actually did a good job of getting participation from students even in a huge lecture hall like this by randomly calling on people's names throughout the entire year. And if you weren't here, you didn't get your attendance points. So I'll show you this lecture hall one more time. On the other side of the spectrum, here is a seminar room in DeBartolo Hall. So it's pretty small. And as you can see, it has a cool, round table where the professor will normally sit at the end and everyone can just talk and this is often used for discussion sections which are break-offs from larger lectures. And on nice days like today, professors will sometimes have class outside which you can see going on right there. <laughs> 